Welcome Aquarians. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. This is the quarto reading for the business uh, um, for you Aquarians. Okay, this reading is for October, November and December. Um, please like and share this video and um, if you'd like to see the extended of this video, um, you can pick up uh, the link below it takes you to my website and you can pick up the reading so i want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back aquarians you're coming in the spirit in the month of october with justice a balance that is coming in some sort of a secret is out it has to do with uh, um um a sagittarian a scorpion some sort of information is coming in about a contract uh, and I see truths are going to be revealed. So Aquarians, this is um, a powerful, powerful uh, uh, quarter um, because the energy of Father Elin is here and it has to do that you're doing, dealing with masculine um, energies. Okay, there is some sort of a masculinity of energy that is happening and transpiring. So you have to be aware of what is uh, happening for you guys, okay? I love using the crystals and these. Um, so what we're seeing here is so very, very important for you Aquarians because um, it's showing up uh, the three months that is coming up and how um, situation is being used uh, how situation has been carried out. Um, you're seeing truths um, um, when it comes up to business. So there is some sort of a um, secrecy, okay? Because we have justice. We have justice and we have um, justice is uh, not fair. So some sort of a situation is going to be happening um, in the month of October where for you, Aquarian, there is some sort of a a situation that is need to um, equally balance out okay so be aware of this it's coming up at the workplace because someone is using their masculine energy in order to create some sort of a problem and you're not seeing it clearly so I would say go pick up um, uh, go pick up uh, the extended reading to find out what is coming up in October for you guys because there are some injustice imbalance situation and it has to do with uh, a gemini for some of you so some of you are dealing with a gemini um at the workplace and it's um the, the justice is not equal um here and you can see this because someone is trying to manipulate a situation around you at the workplace it could be a boss or you're not aware that people are trying to manipulate some sort of a situation so you have to be aware um, because there's some imbalance of justice and you're not seeing it very clearly so in the month of october be on top of your p's and q's because some sort of a, a situation is coming in and there is some um false height or deceptiveness that is at play and you're not seeing what is transpiring that there is some sort of a um uh, issues that is going on that needs to be balanced but it is not balanced out properly and uh, um you're not seeing clearly the situation what is transpiring so be aware um, be on your P's and Q's in the month of October. Check out the month of October reading because you're going to be finding out some thing that is transpiring. Uh, check out, uh, uh, yeah, the month of October and the first week in October and the weeks in October to see what is transpiring because you're dealing with some sort of a um, situation that needs to be balanced out and um, it's not balanced out clearly, okay? So um, you are going to be have to be dealing with this sort of energy. Then in November, I see secrets is coming out about a couple. It doesn't have to be a couple. It could be, yeah, these two people or your uh, business partners and you're dealing with them and some sort of a secrecy 
in November is going to be coming out about these two people. Who are they and what is happening and transpiring? Some sort of an issue, some sort of a situation is coming out about these two people um, that you are um, not aware of uh, that was happening and transpiring. And I see people are finding out uh, what two people have done and they're seeing uh, through the veil of illusions how the, um, two people, this could be um, your boss, your directors, uh, um, that sort of a situation that is going to be coming up. So be aware of this. So you're dealing with your boss, um, your supervisor, your directors. These people could be business partner that you're dealing with also. Some sort of information is going to be coming out about uh, um, these people. Some of you could be dealing with a... Um, uh, a Pisces could be telling you something um, about a Cancer or a Gemini, okay? And um, I see um, that you're going to be finding out and realizing and seeing the truth of a Cancer and a Gemini. And I see a Pisces is going to be coming in in order to alert you of whatever is happening um, um, to you and is affecting you that a Pisces and a Gemini or a Cancer and a Gemini have done something um, wrong, okay? I've done some sort of a um, falseness and it is all going to be coming out. So be aware of that. Then when we look at the month of December, some of you need to protect yourself on the work floor. Some of you are dealing with a Sagittarian man. Um, this could be a boss or a supervisor or just a co-worker. Um, some sort of information is going to be coming in about him. Um, whoever this person is and whatever is transpiring, you got to be, um, you need to stand your ground against this person, whoever this person is, because some sort of a, a message, especially you young people, could be dealing with a boss or a supervisor in the month of December, where some sort of a information is going to be coming out. So the information that is going to be coming out, you have uh, the end energy of the Five of Cups in reverse, where you're not going to be very um, worried about this. I see that you are going to be realizing that um, some changes that need to be done, some sort of a changes that need to be done. So some of you could be hearing that your boss or supervisor is leaving. However, this is happening and transpiring. You're going to be finding out that uh, your boss or supervisor is leaving in the month of December. So, um, you know, please be aware because a lot of you um, need to stand your ground. Whatever is happening and transpiring, a lot of you... Um, really, really need to stand your ground with certain situation that is going to be coming up. Um, you need to understand that you need to speak up about what is happening around you and do not let people walk over you basically, okay? Because people are going to be having the tendency um, to walk over you, but you have to realize that you need to stand up to whatever is going on around you and be alert. You got to be alert and uh, um, be in the present of you standing your grounds. Okay. And this is going to be very, very positive. So what we see is that some sort of a masculine energy, some sort of an overpowering is going to be transpiring. And um, there, there is a situation where you need to protect yourself for the workflow. It doesn't really matter what is coming in. You really need to protect yourself for the work floor. So I see justice is going to be prevailing over a situation. Some sort of a secrecy came out about a Sagittarian on the workplace. A Pisces could be telling you something about the Sagittarian on the workplace. I see you have no regret about this person or regrets with this person. I think you are like, yeah, whatever it is. Let it be because um, this situation needs to be resolved, okay? Then we see some sort of information is going to be coming in um, about a contract. Some sort of a situation about a contract is going to be coming in and a contract with a Gemini. So um, be aware, be open um, because um, some of you are going to be dealing with a Gemini. Some of you are going to be finding out about some sort of a contract where this Gemini could be getting a promotion over you. 
and uh, um, you are going to be, you need to be on top of your game. There's no question about it. You just need to be on top of your game. Some sort of a situation is going to be happening and you have no, um, uh, it is as if you, you, you are open, but you need to stand your ground and protect yourself, Aquarian. Whatever is happening and transpiring, you really need to stand your ground and protect yourself in this third quarter, what is coming up. Because I know you have no regrets over a situation that has transpired, but as you move forward in the next three months that is going to be coming up, you're going to be finding out of some sort of a contract changes that is going to be happening and that is going to be coming in. And uh, some of you are going to be dealing with some sort of a situation with a cancer, uh, some with a Gemini. Some of you are not clearly seeing a situation over a contract, okay? And you got to be aware and alert of what is coming up and transpiring. Some of you could be dealing with some sort of a legal issue. So um, be aware of this because this is definitely, definitely is going to be coming up. So, um... I love this um, for you guys. Um, you need to go and check out and it's, uh, it is uh, advisable for you to constantly check the, re the weekly readings in order to know what is happening, what is transpiring. The weekly readings are very important for you guys to check because what we're seeing here is that uh, some sort of information is going to be coming in. There is no question. There is some sort of a information that is going to be coming in, that is going to be making some sort of a changes that is going to be coming up in your world. And you need to be alert of what is going to be happening. So it is a powerful, powerful um, three months that is coming up. Whatever is happening, whatever is transpiring, these three months are going to be very, very powerful. It's going to be showing you um, something that you were not aware about, a cancer and a Gemini, some sort of a information is going to be coming out about a Cancer and a Gemini and uh, what they have done. Some sort of a information that you were not aware of that is going to be transpiring. Um, so be aware of this. It's going to be alerting you. Some sort of a contract situation is also going to be coming up. So that is also going to be a wonderful change in the energy. I got to go. If you'd like to see the extended of this reading, you can um, connect with us on the other side. Namaste.